Graphs are the most efficient method for displaying information in a simple manner. This form of representation helps the viewer to understand and interpret information more easily and efficiently, which otherwise could be a very difficult and tedious process. Graph is usually used in some mathematical context because it usually contains X and Y axis. In a graph, no data is represented without axis and sometimes it is also divided into grids for easier classification of data. In this chapter, we will learn about Types of Graphs There are different types of graphs used to represent a given data. Bar Graphs A bar graph is used to show the comparison among categories. For example, population of a city during different years can be represented by a graph as shown below. In the year 1980, the population was 25,000. In the year 1990, it was 30,000. In the year 2000, the population was 35,000 and in the year 2010, it was 40,000. Types of Graphs Pie Graphs or Circle Graphs A pie graph is used to compare the parts of a whole. For example, the favorite subject of the students of a school can be represented using a pie graph as shown below. Mathematics 35%, Hindi 15%, Science 25%, English 15% and Social Science 10%. Types of Graphs Histogram A histogram is a bar graph that shows the data in intervals. For example, the heights of 50 students can be shown by using a histogram as shown below. There are 15 persons having the height between 150 centimeters and 160 centimeters, while 20 persons are having the height between 160 centimeters and 170 centimeters. Also, 10 persons are having the height between 170 centimeters and 180 centimeters, and only 5 persons are having the height between 180 centimeters and 190 centimeters. Line graphs. A line graph is that graph which displays those types of data which changes continuously over periods of time. For example, the changes in the speed of a train per hour can be represented by a line graph as shown below. In the first hour, the speed of the train was 57 km per hour. In the second hour, the speed of the train was 60 km per hour. In the third hour, the speed of the train was 58 km per hour. And in the fourth hour, the speed of the train was 55 km per hour.